Hey guys, my name is Tanish Singh Thakur. You're watching Telecom Talk, and today I've got a very interesting piece of news for you. Is that Sunil Bharti Mittal, chairman of Bharti Enterprises, wants to speak to Mukesh Ambani, who's managing director and chairman of Reliance Industries Limited. Now, what could this conversation be about? Just watch the video till the end, and you'll find out. Sunil Bharti Mittal, chairman of Bharti Enterprises, wants the telecom operators to come together for building a unified strategy and reviving the sector. Mittal said that the telcos have been cutting each other for getting a larger market share, but it is high time that the industry regroups and focuses on building a sustainable business. For the same, Mittal recently spoke to Nick Reid, who is the CEO of Vodafone Group PLC, and encouraged him to take necessary steps and cover the lost ground. Mittal reiterated that the government had done its part in helping the sector, so now it is time for the telcos to step up as well. Mittal said that he is also planning to speak to Mukesh Ambani, Managing Director and Chairman, Reliance Industries Limited, for coming together and building a coordinated approach to revive the industry. Mittal said that he would talk to Ambani about cooperating in areas such as sharing of fiber infrastructure, market practices, and data centers. According to an ET Telecom report, Mittal further said that Airtel is ready to take the lead in some areas. Now, it is clearly indicated that Mittal meant tariffs here. Bharti Airtel might become the first telecom operator in India to go for aggressive tariffs. Mittal expects the ARPU, which is the average revenue per user, to touch Rs 200 by the end of the financial year 2022. Further, Mittal said that Airtel will opt for the relief measures from the government and would defer the adjusted gross revenue and spectrum payments to improve the cash flow of the company. According to Mittal, deferment of payments would mean a breather of about Rs 35,000 to Rs 40,000 crore and an interest of Rs 7,000 crore on top of that. It was interesting to see Mittal saying that Airtel wants to see the details of the government taking equity in the company against the interest payments. This means Airtel is open to offering an equity stake to the government if the deal favors. So this was it for today guys. Hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please click on that like button. Please share it with your friends and do not forget to click on the subscribe button followed by that bell button. See you.